All right, what is this, episode 16? Our uh, fight with the Austro-Hungarian Empire continues with uh, more good news. Uh, Julius von Wagner is replaced by Franz Ferdinand. And he's just, uh, he's just screaming for me to take him out. So, you know, we'll do that. Destroyers up to 900 tons. Anti-flooding, too. Ooh, 7-inch Mark, uh, Mark II 7-inch guns. Ooh. Ooh. Mark two seven inch guns, meaning we can upgrade our cruisers, uh light cruisers main armament. What do we have here? Fight auto resolve. Ooh. Come on. Oh. That hurt. I'll take it. All right. That actually pushes us over 400,000. I think we were actually already there. I just didn't notice at the start of the turn. We've almost completely beat down their Navy. They're in negative growth. So we're just going to keep pushing this until they break. Let's see how long that takes. All right. So our first major batch of battleships was, was uh, completed. That was... 40 something we still have a few more on order that are coming in of a slightly different class well more than slightly different they're like three times the price but that's besides the point uh, so we have to go through and set the crew on all of these but uh we'll do that off screen just showing the one of the two delivered products so far anyways be back real quick. All right, there you go. I finished activating the battleships. We're now at 90 active battleships with, uh, with uh, a total of 354 ships. And dear gosh, most of the ports are full now, like minus one or two. About Gibraltar. Gibraltar's fine. Blade is fine. Yeah. Cyprus is good. Sweet. Next. Right and last of the ships that need un unmothballing that were new. Uh, there's apparently a few torpedo boats that I built that I forgot to put into service. But also we have the Royal Oak class battleship. Which is going to be uh, about a few bucks to run. And we're only building a few of them. They're, they're specifically for going after destroyers, cruisers, all that jazz. So they cost a fair chunk of change to make. Because they run at 30.6 knots. But I digress. Anyways. Get these things in service. So somehow, despite saying, "Hey, screw you, I want to keep fighting," they've decided to uh, force a peace deal, even though I had a minor victory. Somehow, so I'll take my three hundred million and walk away, even though I can't get territory. Even though that's what I want, I want territory. And you know what we're gonna do? We're just gonna keep sitting in their waters and. Uh, Oh, they cut our naval budget in half, which means we're probably, oh, okay, we need to start a war quick. How do we do that? Well, I have 17 battleships sitting here, so that's what we're going to use to start a war. We're going to park them in German waters and laugh. And eventually, oh, well, you know what, let's make that 27. Oh, 26. Yeah, no, we're just going to do this. Come at me, bro. We're, we're going to leave these task force in place to ensure shipping. We should have well over 100,000 power projection after this next turn. And maybe, just maybe, we'll get lucky. So that 300k that we got from... Or 300 million that we got from... Uh, 
Austria-Hungary is pretty much just gone. Can any of these give us money? No, oh, screw them. We're going to have more war. Ah, and we got done. Right. Let's see what that jumped us back up to. Ah, okay, we're back where we need to be. We're at 10%, so we can do that. Let's check it out, see what we got into. Not that I imagine very much. Really? Auto resolve. Just gonna, like, pause recording until something fun comes up. Hey, look, something fun came up. Uh, we had our battle with the Germans. Uh, crop up here, and we're we're on the tonnage advantage for this uh, battle, but they got three battleships versus our five 8,500 ton heavy cruisers and the rest of our heavy cruisers and light cruisers and all that jazz, so it's going to be an interesting one, I think, I hope. There's a lot of destroyers, a lot of torpedo boats, as per usual. I'm not too worried about them. These should keep them at bay while we figure out how to deal with the battleships. Anyways, I'll see you in. Alright, here we go. We're looking to find, uh... Find the enemy ships, and they're all north, supposedly, so we're gonna just go north. Four. You can go north. Five. You can also go north. Uh, any more battle lines? Everybody's doing a cool 22. We should probably go through and just kind of turn these off so they don't do stupid things because their prediction is to... Uh, It's honestly a little bit too stupid. So we just turn the the collision avoidance off and micromanage. Why? Because it works better. They kind of just sort themselves out eventually. Alright, we're still going north here. Hopefully these cruisers will pick something up. I think they're still in the Mark 1s. Yeah. So I know the Mark seven or the uh seven inches got a mark to upgrade recently and oh yeah no the sixes are already upgraded so that's good uh we're seeing shots we're gonna pull to the left here and smoke up try to keep them uh, back while the rest of the cruisers come into play like that. Is that a heavy cruiser? Nope, that's a, that's a destroyer. We're gonna turn on the void. Now we gotta pin down where those battleships are. Try to avoid some collisions. Come on, guys. Don't be stupid. What are these? These are the 8500s. They'll make quick work of the, the destroyers. Not so much the 11 inches, but the uh, 5 inches should. Once the smoke clears, at least. Which is probably when they're at their most dangerous. So they can do, what, 35 knots? So you have to think, you know, how much, uh, obviously, behind, uh, beyond a certain range, the smoke is going to make them basically impervious if they're at speed. But it, it'll, uh,. It'll allow them to get a lot closer, probably within torpedo distance, if they pushed it. So you have to be careful. Those are screens.
pulling these guys back in. We'll send in some light cruisers here to see if we can get some spots. Gonna push this group up here to the, the east, the northeast of that uh, puddle of destroyers there, and see if we can see some other stuff. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. So there's at least one battleship in that direction. So we're gonna start heading that direction with our heavy cruisers. Start dropping speed on some of these. Pull you back in. We're gonna get them to smoke up again because they're getting some attention. hit by another hit right here unless we get lucky and get a torpedo hit on him nope that is one of the older ones unfortunately it happens oh you poor cruisers what happened to you well, at least you sunk some destroyers Looking at trying to get to those uh, those two ships there. Now I don't want to send light cruisers, because that's just a bad time. know if these are newer battleships and I don't know how well the uh, the 9 inch guns are going to do up the, against them so that's why I'm trying to get the 11 inches through well they're already targeting him Twenty-two thousand tons at fifteen inches. That's not the main belt, is it? No, eleven point seven. So I can make that work, I think. No. Okay, well at least not from here, but and definitely not with that cruiser anymore. Get out of the 
the way of those. You know what? They can take that. Apparently they just had a friendly fire torpedo incident. What? That's funny. Uh, we're gonna we're we're gonna jump on this with everything. Torpedo hit. We're gonna change to that. They're at 21 fires, they're at 9 so far. Wow, that was lucky. Fires almost a thousand damage. We'll bring the cruisers in back for another round. Torpedoes boat's doing work, man. Forty two, thirty five, they're both well over a thousand damage on that. Oh, we got pens on these two. I'm liking where this is going. Oh, well, though, he's gonna just send it full. Let's hope that doesn't mess him up too bad.
There's one. This one should go any minute. Just gonna full send it everything. Well, you're already stuck in. Okay. Well, fearless. So dead. Kinda send these guys in, sorta, not really. Oh, you should probably come back like cruisers. We need you. We're going to send all our screens forward. Why? Because it's funny. And we're going to send our torpedo boats forward. Oh, they have a third battleship. Oh, this isn't one of the crazy ones. Okay, thank god. You know, just everybody just light it up. Throw shells at this guy until he disappears. Targets real quick here. Tell them to go away. Oh, we lost the cruiser. Oh well. You have torpedoes. You know what? Make the torpedo carrier go away. It only works like half the time now. Okay, he's gone. Shoot that. It'll disappear eventually. Start that game. And you are gonna shoot at him. You are gonna shoot at him. You are gonna shoot at him. Oh, there goes a torpedo boat. There goes their heavy cruiser, and this should be the end of their battleship. Excellent. That should be used. The last ship. Oh dear. Good night. 
Yeah, that's that's how you do that. There should just be a bunch of torpedo boats left. Oh, it's the transports. I forgot about the transports. Oh well. I'll take it. Five for thirty-eight, that's pretty good.